The Mandela effect is fake. It's not real. So I pose the question, is the Mandela effect real or is it fake? It's, it's fake. So uh, I've debunked all these Mandela effects, you know, the Ed McMahon Mandela effect, the Berenstein Bears Mandela effect, um, you name it. I, I, I've debunked them all, all the Bible Mandela effects and much, much more. And the reason why I'm making this video is because I think it's really important as a truther. I've been a truther for eight years promoting the flat earth and other important truths. Vaccines cause autism and abortion is murder and much, much more. Um, and I think it's really important to point out as a truther things that actually aren't true that muddy the waters in uh, the truth community. So the Mandela effect, does it exist? Are, are there is CERN bombarding particles and there's alternate realities and that's why there's Berenstain and Berenstein bears, um, et cetera, et cetera. The, the uh, I love Lucy uh, Mandela effects. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about, that's great. Feel free to look into the Mandela Effect and just know it's fake 100%. It's important because a lot of people who I know who are in the truth community actually somewhat subscribe and think maybe it's true, this whole Mandela Effect theory. Well, it's not true. It's 100% provably fake, just like, uh, you know, in uh, Moonraker, uh, you know, supposedly Dolly's braces, uh, she was wearing braces, but in, in, in this reality now she wasn't. Well... I've debunked that one because uh, the main actress herself said she never wore braces. The director of the movie said she never wore braces. Um, the special effects crew said that they never created a cast for her to wear braces. Uh, so it's, it's obviously not true. Um, are we to really believe with no proof as a truth community that alternate realities exist because you don't understand why, uh, you know, you remember mm -hmm. something a certain way? Well, here's the answer why. I've debunked all of these differing supposed Mandela effects. I've debunked them all. And here's the bottom line. A lot of times, like for example, Star Wars. Uh, no, I am your father, says Darth Vader. Oh, you I am your father. No, I am your father. Why do many people remember him saying, Luke, I am your father? Well, remember, you watched this a long time ago. You didn't pay attention to every part. And there's other things that influence your decision making. For example, uh, Tommy Boy, he said famously, Chris Farley said, Luke, I am your father, joking around in the fan. Luke, I am your father. Well, that became a very popular uh, comment for people to make. And it therefore got stuck in people's heads. Luke, I am your father instead of no, I am your father, uh, is what Darth Vader had really said in reality. There are no parallel universes. That's insanity to think that. And I hope that you know that the Mandela effect isn't true so that we don't muddy the waters so people don't say, oh, you guys are crazy. You conspiracy theorists are crazy. Uh, no, we're not. We're actually here to promote truth so that we can have a better understanding of the real world, world that we live in so we can make better decisions for ourselves and for our loved ones.